Cool. Atlas. Persona 3, Dancing in Moonlight. Sega. Oh, you're awake. Are you okay? No clue. We woke up here. Maybe we should just go back to sleep. Maybe you should just sleep forever. Everyone else is here too. This place is strange. It doesn't make any sense. I went to sleep in my own room. As did I. When I woke, I was here with the others. Everyone's here. Could this be an attack? <laughs> Yamagishi, do you have an understanding of the situation? There are no signs of shadows. It seems we're safe for now, but... Huh? What the... Ladies and gentlemen! <laughs> Elizabeth. I have been waiting for you. Welcome to the Velvet Room. <clears throat> I mean, for one night only, a magical paradise where a gathering of passionate souls revel as one. Welcome to Club Velvet. Whoa, that was unexpected. I mean, what's going on here? Who are you? That was merely an ingenious orchestration of a dazzling entrance. No big deal. Uh, you're calling yourself a genius? Whatever, she's such a hottie. You know her? No way. When did you meet her? But that means she's not an enemy, right? Well, what do you want with us? Ah, uh, yes. Allow me to explain. However, I will not answer any more questions until I am done. She... she's kind of overbearing, huh? You think we're gonna be okay? Due to an incident involving my sisters, we shall be holding a ball here. Accordingly, I have summoned you all to proudly participate in the festivities. A ball? You mean like a party? Ooh, sounds like fun. I'm totally down for that. Hold on, Iori. This doesn't seem like just any old party. What do you want us to do? Ah, oh, yes. Thank you for asking. 
I would like for you, my guests, to dance for me. Dance? dance? What? Oh, there's no need for rumination. It's as simple as following your heart and releasing your passion on stage. Uh, it doesn't sound simple. Sorry, but we don't have time for this. Ah, there's no need to worry about that. In the real world, you are all fast asleep. What happens here will only take place tonight, and then it will vanish like a fleeting dream. Regardless of how much time you spend here, it will not have any effect on reality. Um, so since we're in a dream, we can spend as long as we want here, and it won't matter? Yes, perfectly stated. In addition, once you wake in the real world, your memories from this place will all be removed. It will be quick and painless, allowing you to rise and shine just like any other morning. So please enjoy your time here to your heart's content. It's easy for her to say. Does she really expect us to go along with this? Why must we dance, though? You need to give us a reason. Why, you ask? Hmm, well... On a very dark journey. I can only imagine how stressful it must be. I apologize for my audacity, but I only wish to provide you with some relaxation. Thus, I prepared such an occasion to lift your spirits for the days to come. Will this explanation suffice? You just thought of that, didn't you? Should you? Refuse me! I would have no one else to turn to! I would be unable to even the score with my incompetent sister for all of eternity. And without a doubt, my dignity would be trampled in the mud. Your sister? Oh, don't let it trouble you. That is truly a personal affair after all. Anyway... I thought I had done my utmost to support this man's journey from the shadows. Yet to think you won't even oblige one teensy little request from me. However, the blame rests solely with me. My sadness is deeper than the color of this room. <laughs> She's crying. Those are obviously crocodile tears. She's attempting to appeal to our emotions. Uh, however, her acting lacks any true sentiment. What are we gonna do? You're indebted to her, right? I guess so. And she's an ally. And if that's the case, we can't turn our backs on her. Where's Sinji? I'm okay with it. What about you guys? I don't mind either. It's not like I have any strong objections. Wait, what? You're actually okay with dancing? <laughs> you have all accepted my terms, yes? A guest never goes back on their word, so our contract has been sealed. Now then, I ask that you all dance passionately into your heart's content. I knew it. She didn't even try to hide how quickly her mood changed. <laughs> but I didn't agree to it. First off, none of us have any dance skills or techniques. What will be done about that? Not to worry, as I am well aware. 
Club Velvet is a mysterious space that only exists within your dreams. Your emotions will be transformed into dance moves. Enabling your body to move exactly how you imagine it to. It's merely child's play here. <sighs> she completely has the upper hand. It seems we've fallen right into her trap. Fine by me. Sounds fun. Well, basically, we just have to dance and rile up the crowd, right? Um... Uh... Oh, I beg your pardon. It seems I forgot to introduce myself. You're Elizabeth. The one who will be guiding... No. <laughs> Producing you is me. My name is Elizabeth. Please feel free to call me by my nickname, LP. Fine, whatever. So then, what do we need to do? Please tell us in more detail, uh, LP. Yes, just as Kenny Boy said. We're <laughs> pressed for time here. Permit me to wrap things up and get right to the point. Uh, he didn't say that. And what's with a forced use of idioms? I shall gracefully forego the insignificant details and tell you about Club Velvet. First, this room you are in now is the VIP room, exclusively for your private use. as you wish, be it to practice or to chat with one another. Oh, so this isn't where we'll be performing? The dance floor where you will actually perform is located just outside this room. The images in a dancer's heart will create the stage on which they'll perform within reason. Within reason? That sounds scary coming from her. In addition, I have prepared a separate waiting room for each of you. Yo, for real? <laughs> We're like celebrities! To ensure that your waiting rooms will have a most relaxing effect on you, I have created each one to reflect the very rooms in which you spend your daily lives. Oh yeah, like in a dorm room. I'll give you your key so that until it's time to perform, you can relax whole heart. No. Whole wheat? Whole, whole grain? Well, whatever. Relax how you would like. Our rooms? You mean our dorm rooms? Good. Then I can train. See, I knew it. You're accepting this way too easily, senpai. Plus, what's the point of training in a dream? Now then. As leader of the dance team, please get this party started.
Oh, why me? <sighs> Wait, what? You're our leader here, too? That's fine with me. You're best suited after all. Go ahead. Uh, is everyone ready? Yeah! It's time to party! Let the music play! <laughs> huh? She did it herself! Guess we'll just have to give this a go. By the way, I'm ready whenever. I'm still a bit lost, but I'll make sure to be ready too. We'll look to you, leader. Yo, Does I'm anyone getting have for any this? Yes, I'm this is very interesting. I'm not sure. Why don't we check out our waiting rooms? Damn, so much blue. The right stick.
Oh, that doesn't seem too bad. Perfect. Yeah, so much blue. What the hell? Double D's. Fuck! 
Quand on regarde. <sighs> what? Yeah. Game bread. How's the bread? I don't know about the bread. Find it in Laya, Musa. It's five in Talaya. I don't know. Find it. Find it. I don't know how to get Fuck. Even if you have two bread, that's fine. Nope. Ah, shit. Dang it. Time to go back to his regular. Oh, uh, yeah, there's two. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's okay. We make two, two, two bread. Actually, nah, it's, it's kind of hard. Musa! I forget it. Uh, I'll just eat it as it is. Give me a plate.
That was fun. <laughs> uh, actually, time it. Get to the towards the main event. <coughs> when you Ah, uh, yes, no, hit, <laughs> hit. This kind of crap's not really my thing, you know? Now this always gets me psyched. <laughs> God damn it. No. 
just had it. Nothing to worry about. Stay calm. Keep it up. Don't stop. Keep it up. Don't stop. Fuck. Oh no! Damn, God. is that really it? Not clear. That was shit. <coughs> God damn it! <laughs> Persona 3, Dancing in Moonlight. Oh, what the hell? That was hard.
shadows all mass destruction. <coughs> Too bad. Don't shut up, don't mess. Destruction. Time to get started. <coughs> All right, let's dance. I'm rooting for you. How's that? Whoa. Yes. That's it. Great. Finally here. Now's my chance. How's that? Not half bad. That's it. Whoa. You show up a grown up like me, though. That's it. I'm rocking it, huh? How's that? Results either. Wow, you cleared that with ease. Don't shut up, don't mess. Destruction. get what's going on here this is a dream right in reality we're all asleep in our beds which means we're all having the same dream and we don't have to worry about time right we'll forget everything when we wake up well 
No sense in overthinking it. I'll go with the flow. It's scary how used to this I am. Somehow, it just feels like another day to me. A few years ago, I would have been freaking out. I adjust to things way too fast. Dancing, though? That really came out of nowhere. Nope, but nothing ventured, nothing gained, right? Oh, but I think I can picture myself doing it. I like music, and I watch dance videos. What else? Uh, cheerleading? I kind of used to think that was cool. But I turned down the cheerleading club when they asked me to join. I was too embarrassed. What about you? Ever tear up the dance floor anywhere? Like at Club Escapade? <laughs> <laughs> what, really? Whoa, no way. <laughs> well, I guess that'll come in handy here, huh? Uh, I used to be interested in dancing, so this seems like a good chance to try it out. Honestly, I still think this is crazy, but then again, I can dance my heart out here. I'll be counting on you if something happens, okay? You seem like you can handle anything. I think I'll go practice. It's our job to hype up the crowd, right? Okay, time to dance. I'm gonna be the disco queen. Huh? Is that not right? Friday night. <coughs> what to do? Oh, it's you. I understand that we can dance here just by imagining it. I've been trying it out myself. However, I've never danced in a setting like this before. Oh, come now. You give me far too much credit. I've never dealt with this sort of thing. The closest would be ballroom dancing. And even that's an overstatement. I only learned the basics to perform on the floor. Thus, I have no confidence in riling up the crowd as we were instructed. So you think I should just go with the flow? Perhaps that's all I can do. Then I'll give it a try. Turning my back on this would be a disgrace as a Kirijo. I swear on my family's name to make the crowd's cheers all mine. <laughs> Quite. If I were to falter now, putting on a great show would be beyond my wildest dreams. I'll be sure to reference everyone's dancing. Sorry, but I'll need your help when I do so. All right then, time to pull myself together and get to practicing. You'll join me, no?
<laughs> yes. Shine at times like these, Junpei. Tuning to do though. You sure know how to put on a show, Akihiko san. leader I've just concluded practicing as well I guess your dancing is so amazing I feel even more inspired now <laughs> Fuka-san you seem happy being here your expression is more carefree than usual oh yes dancing with everyone has been great it's like we get our own little school club uh. I've only ever been in liberal arts uh. clubs so I've always dreamed of joining a sports club. I'm ready to cheer on everyone! Huh? Oh no, I'll try to dance too! But, I'm not great at physical activities, so I thought I might help more as a support. Even if that is the case, isn't this situation optimal for your attempts? According <laughs> to LP, our bodies will perform any dance moves exactly as we imagine them. Thus, 
Even if you lack talent in physical activities, such an issue is no matter here. Well, I guess that's true. Yeah. My assessment is that the only necessity for your successful dancing is self-confidence. You previously mentioned that you consider dancing to be fun, <sighs> like a club activity. You should then consider this place as our dance club, with yourself as its president. <laughs> Me, the president? Uh, I don't think I could do it. <laughs> the title is merely a presumption, but this will allow you to achieve your dream. Well, that's true. You're right. It'd be much more difficult to do it any time besides now. All right, I'll do my best for the dance cheer club. <laughs> That, that. Oh, of course I'll dance, but I also really want to cheer everyone on as they perform. I've been providing support whenever we went to Tartarus and dealt with shadows. So I want to use my strongest skills and help everyone while we're here too. It's true that dancers try harder if they are being cheered on. That sounds like fun. <laughs> Then it's decided. I hereby elect myself president of the dance cheer club. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Thanks. I guess it is a bit daring for my oh. usual self. After all, we are in a dream. This might not be the best way to put it, but... Since we'll forget everything when we wake up, I'd rather go and try new things. In that case, one must strike while the iron is hot. I will now resume practice, so please cheer me on, Fuka-san. All right. Fun. <laughs> it, it's Junpei. Yay. Hey, it's our leader. What's up? You here to practice? I'm just passing by. Thank you. The ball is off to a smooth start. It seems this talented producer was correct about you all. Please excuse my audacity, but my heart is dancing as well. Nice. <laughs> I'm starting to get into the groove, too. We're totally going to liven up this party. What promising words. Please enjoy the ball with your friends. But man, this place sure is strange. <sighs> My body moves exactly how I imagine it to. There is that. However, Club Velvet is merely the manifestation of the strength of your heart. Strength of our heart? You mean like our persona? Indeed! As you know, a persona is the strength of one's heart. Club Velvet is no different from your persona ability. The images you hold so dear in your heart manifest as movement. The strength of your heart equates to the strength of the passion you emit when dancing. I ask that you strive to make your mic drops reverberate and secure victory for me. What? Huh? Victory? Does that mean we're competing against someone? Nah. Oh my, how carelessly thoughtless of me. It seems I've made a slip of the tongue. In short, this is a big fight between me and my younger sister. Our pride is on the line. Ah, One sister or two. I mentioned something like that at the start. Oh. A brash older sister as well a short while ago her guest resolved a certain incident by dancing our primary role is to assist our guest and watch over them on their journey just as you are my guest my older sister has a guest as well Narakami. upon hearing that my younger sister said our guest could have resolved it faster 
Her words lit an infernal flame within me. What about my guest, I thought? Would he be defeated? No, he would never! Uh, so basically you stood up to your sister, huh? Man, you're totally into this guy. I gotta admit, though, he's no average Joe. <sighs> However, my impertinent sister wouldn't back down, so I came up with a plan. My older sister's guest resolved a situation with dance. So I stole, <laughs> I mean, <sighs> borrowed that idea and organized a dance competition with their guest. Are we? <laughs> Seems like it. Well, as long as it's fun. So how do we figure out who the winner is? Whoever moves the crowd most is kind of vague. The cheers that echo across the stage are the voices that rise from the sea of souls. In other words, countless unseen spectators are waiting in anticipation to watch you dance. How frenzied the audience is will be apparent, so the winner should be obvious. <sighs> uh, I'd like to say I get it, but I don't. Well, is there some kind of reward for winning? <laughs> I'll try even harder if there is. Of course there is. For real? Yes. In the event that you emerge victorious, I will forever honor your names as the most remarkable guests for generations to come. Uh... Wait, that's it? Above all, as your producer, your victory is also my victory. Thus, my impertinent younger sister will have been totally served, and I'd be ecstatic. Wow, I'm impressed with her honesty. And if we lose? We will all fall into an eternal hell of endless suffering and humiliation. Uh, hell? How vicious is your younger sister? Yeah, I mentioned that. There's no need to worry. When you wake, those memories will have disappeared into oblivion and be forgotten. Castle Oblivion. That's not the issue here, and that smile's freaking me out. Then again, this is a private affair among sisters. Please do not let it worry you. As your producer, all I ask is that you perform amazing dance routines. You can do it, my dear guests. If you can't do it, no one can. We got this, right? I mean, our team's got the amazing me and you. I'm gonna go tell everyone to give it their all. I'll be counting on you, too. Uh -oh. Oh, it's nothing. Although I am not worthy. I, LP, will do my utmost to help you be victorious at this ball. Hmm. <sighs> As you know, this room exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. Space and even time escape the chains that would normally bind them. However, this is still a transient, fleeting dream that only lasts one night. <laughs> transient! Please, do not forget this, regardless of the fate that awaits you on the road ahead. Oh. Then, there is nothing more that I must say. In any case, please focus your efforts on livening up the ball. Now, as I am quite busy being your talented producer, I shall take my leave. God gases.
Fuck you, Gora. Hi, Ketchy. I thought her name was Akira. <laughs> Ah, Crow, shall dance for you. I hate this guy. Like, Must remain focused. <laughs> you really stand out from the crowd. Oh, hell no. I remember this. <laughs> How's that? Okay. Okay. clear that was a good performance so when's the next one well done I better step up my game as well still a douche
Sephiroth. Oh, is it my turn? Super Roth. You so easily confused. We're starting. You so easily confused. Let's warm up first. You can do it, Yukari san. Whoa. Looking good, Looking cool, Joker. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Oh, you're here to practice too? Woo! 
Whew, that was a good workout. I'm gonna take a little break. <laughs> Being together like this, it's almost like we're back in the dorm. This dream rocks. I don't have to go to class, and my room is the same as it is in reality. Oh, you mean our waiting rooms? Yeah, I was surprised. <sighs> it looks just like my actual room. It even has all the same things in it. How does that work? Like, I wanted to listen to a CD, but it wasn't in its case here, either. Hmm. Wait. Uh, what's up, Yucatan? <sighs> I just realized that I let you borrow that CD, Junpei. Uh, you remembered that, huh? Unbelievable. Give it back already. Yeah, wait, please. Just let me hold on to it for a little longer. Actually, uh, can I borrow a few more? Uh, are you kidding me? How about you give back what you've already got first? Wait. Hmm. Oh, nice one, dude! Oh, that's too bad. Nothing we can do about it, huh? <laughs> oh, you little... Well, I guess this is a dream, so we'll forget everything when we wake up. <sighs> All right, just forget Stephen for now. <laughs> oh, you hey, bitch. You're always wearing earphones, huh? What kind of stuff do you listen to? <sighs> oh, like classical? I can sort of picture that. For me, it's got to be rock and maybe a little pop. I'm a pretty good singer myself, you know? Don't believe me? <laughs> Wait till I'm on stage. Uh, don't know, don't want to know. Ah, come on! At least listen! Music sure is interesting, though. Just listening to it is enough to fire someone up or make them cry. It can even make you remember the past, if you listen to a song from that time. Right? Memories just come flooding back. Yeah, I was so young and foolish back in the day. Not that you really learned anything. Ah, lay off! I worked hard to get where I am. The music we listened to this year, it's definitely linked to our memories. Maybe we'll end up remembering this place after all. So we have to do our best. I don't want my memories of this place to be embarrassing. Okay, I mean, we won't get a chance like this again, right? Yeah, that's true. I'm raring to go too. This is gonna be the best night ever. We're gonna forget everything anyway, so we don't have to worry about Junpei messing up. I do wish I could remember seeing everyone on stage though. Wait, why am I the only one getting singled out here? Okay, I can do this. Yamagishi, stay confident. This is starting to be fun.
could only be shown by someone like you. As I'd expect from you, Mitsuno Sentai, amazing moves! You're a perfect tandem! You were the highlight of the stage! Truly magnifique! How's this? Oh, yeah! Rest. Yay! This is starting to be fun! Yeah! Time to nail this! The crowd's really hyped up! Yes, everyone is in high spirits! Stage clear. I did everything I could, but I really want to dance better next time. Good, you managed to pull through. about to discuss something with LP. I am an anti-shadow weapon. I was born for the purpose of fighting. I'm glad that someone such as myself can partake in a peaceful activity like dancing. Thank you for inviting me. I will do my very best. Please, this is a ball. Let us dispense with such formality. You need to get peaced out, I guess, and display your explosive vibes at full force. If you require anything for that purpose, please do not hesitate to ask. Thank you very much. In that case, I would like to take you up on your offer. This is a brand new experience for me, so I will need to be outfitted properly for it. In other words, I will need 7th generation anti-shadow suppression dance armaments. Oh my! What a pleasant ring that has to it! I am most intrigued! Yes, I was wondering which loadout would be best. May I ask your opinion on multi-barrel rotary machine guns? They have the greatest area of effect, and the gunshot flashes will generate a lot of height. <laughs> My heart is simply a flutter at the thought. It will be quite an innovative performance. Next, I would like mounted multi-rocket launchers. I was thinking of using the recoil from firing to create a unique type of movement. 
I would also like some stun grenades and signal flares to give myself more options. No weapons, please. You don't approve? I thought it was such a good idea. But I see your point. It is meaningless if I disregard basic movements. Let's discuss my dance armaments later. For now, I will manage with my current loadout. My combat protocols do not include dancing, but it seems I can review image data. Please allow me to consult you should the need arise. I will do the best I can. Revenge cup. <laughs> I must say, though, I am a tad disappointed. Perhaps we can still try it in private. Very well. We can just call it a one-shot test fire. Why settle for one shot when you can do two or three? No. I am extremely disappointed, <sighs> but very well. If I guess is not permitted to do so, then perhaps I will conduct the test on my own. I'll do it. <laughs> Something like this should be nothing. Not looking half bad, Shinji. How's this? Bring it on. 
brings back memories, eh, Shinji? <laughs> I got heated up too, you know, thanks to Aki. Max Voltage! <laughs> Looks like I gotta acknowledge your skills, Aki. More. Huh. How's this? Huh. <laughs> More. <laughs> How's this? Huh. like I expected. Not bad. Not bad at all. Can't wait to see you improve more and more. should also practice my cheering. After all, I'm the president of the club. I was doing some simple visualization training when you came over. I thought that I might cheer more naturally if I pretend our party's inside Tardis. <sighs> Hi, what are you doing? Oh, Ken-kun! Were you two practicing your dancing? Mm. No, we were actually talking about the dance cheer club. Cheer club? What's that? Well... I see. You'll be cheering us on as we dance. But I feel like that might be kind of distracting. <sighs> what? Not you too, Ken-kun! Yeah, you're right. I'm the club president. Say, Ken-kun, why don't you try practicing some cheers with me? Me? Mm -hmm. <sighs> I mean, you call out to the others when they're dancing too, right? This isn't any different than doing that. Um, well, that is true. Okay, then let's give it a try. Go, go, go! Leader, go! Show us all the moves you know! <laughs> what? I don't really think that's my sort of thing. <sighs> You're just gonna leave me to hang by myself? Man, adults aren't fair at all. Hey, we teen Follow my lead. The teenagers. Go, go, go. I, uh, go, go, go. Show us all the moves you know. Should show us all of your moves that... Okay, this is definitely not gonna happen.
Huh. Not just like Theodore. Brilliant! Burn my dread! Senpai showed up while we were practicing, so we're just chilling for a bit. Hmm, impressive, Akihiko. Especially how you've incorporated boxing into your moves. What's the deal, Mitsuru? Praise me all you want, but I don't have anything for you. Sorry, just ignore me. I'm here to analyze everyone's dancing styles and moves. I had hoped to reference them so I could perform even better on stage. Well, look at you, dedicated as ever. <laughs> Fine by me. Would you mind practicing with them as well? I'd like to see some of your best moves, too. Thank you. I apologize for causing you so much trouble all the time. Well, let's do this then. Watch us rock, Mitsuru Senpai. <sighs> so, did watching us end up doing you any good, Mitsuru Senpai? Yes, that was greatly helpful. Your dance is gentle, yet powerful. It's both fluid and still, most mysterious. It was almost as if I were watching you fight. It was quite exciting. And nobody here want to fight. <laughs> Your splendid footwork and weight shifting showcase your fitness. You each have your own forte, and your routines reflect your personalities. 
That may be the exact approach I need. I'll strive to imbue my moves with my personality. How about me, Senpai? Uh, what part of my dancing blew you away? Or was it my whole routine? Oh, Iori, you, uh... Uh-huh. Well, you were very energetic. What? Huh? That's it? Does Senpai not really care about me at all? No, I just wanted to give our leader the opportunity to contribute his own thoughts. Oh yeah? Well then let me have it. I totally thrive off compliments. I mean comments. Right. That's... that's really vague. That's fine. No one cares about me. I'm just some nobody. Don't be so discouraged, Iori. Let's all come up with some positive aspects of your dance. Hmm. We might be able to come up with at least one thing if all three of us think on it. You're not trying to cheer me up at all, are you? <laughs> She's gonna turn it off. Yes, get out. <laughs> oh, hey, are you here to practice too? Mm. I just finished, so I was chatting with LP. Looks like our dancing is a hit. The stage has been on fire thanks to your sharp moves. Perhaps that is where the phrase, night fever opens all doors, comes from. See? I don't understand what she's saying, but that's gotta mean we're doing great, right? A deal. By the by, Harry, <sighs> how is your waiting room? Let me know if you need anything. Oh, that? I was so surprised. It's exactly like my real room. I thought that you'd be able to best relax in your own rooms. Uh, has my careful preparation as a talented producer struck a chord with you? <laughs> yeah. I'm delighted to hear that. Then it was worth going through all the trouble. Like anyway, mm. it's really impressive. Mine's nearly perfect, even though it's a dream. One might say that it's the result of my daily observations. <laughs> I've watched you from morning till night and committed every detail to memory. Oh, pfft. That's creepy. What the fuck? He has a point. That means you've been watching us this whole time, right? There's no need to worry. True to my duties, I won't speak a word of what I've learned. Such as the type of books Junpei collects, or the style of underwear Mitsuru prefers. <laughs> type of books? Or even what you recently purchased, Yukari. I believe it was diet... Whoa, stop right there. You're spilling all our secrets. Oh, pardon me. Gosh, so much for not speaking a word. How closely have you been watching us? My interest continues to be piqued with every action you all take in reality. Everything I laid my eyes upon unveiled a new surprise. It's all thanks to you that my eyes turn to the outside world. As a result, my view has expanded exponentially. I am grateful for that. Hmm, seems like she really trusts you. That must be why you were summoned this time, too. Of course. That is thanks to his friends as well. I have seen that you are capable of manifesting greater powers because you support one another. Ah, <laughs> thanks. It's a trust you. You're good at maneuvering us as well, LP. Maybe you really do have a gift for this. I am honored by the compliment. Please enjoy the ball to your heart's content. Well, I'm gonna rest in my room until my turn. Might as well make use of it. Oh, before you go, there's something I forgot to tell you. The waiting rooms appear to be adjacent, but they are separate and completely soundproof. 
assured that you can bang all you want in there, no problem. Yeah. We'd never do that. I mean, what are you implying? <laughs> Bang. Is there a problem with making as much noise as you need when practicing your dance moves? Oh, never mind. Being watched is a bigger problem anyway. Please be at ease. My lips are sealed with regards to what I have learned via my duties. That <sighs> doesn't put me at ease at all. My charisma's off the charts! Looks really different. Go a little faster. A herb. Let's dance. Mm hmm Camera's rolling. I feel like you'll find a way no matter what, Junpei Kun. You're on a roll. Junpei-kun, that was 
so fun. The time just flew by. Nice, Fuka. That was perfect. Nice. This is fun. Thanks, Fuka. You put me at ease. Those are some deaf moves. <laughs> Stage clear. Woo, that was close. Can't afford to get sloppy. You did it. Now let's keep stepping up our game. Persona 3, Dancing in Moonlight. Ah, that was the Persona Three Dancing in Moonlight. All right, uh, I'm gonna stop. <laughs> <laughs> 